Hello, uh, internet. I don't know. I don't know what to say. I'm not a YouTuber, um, but I will say this: this video is meant for people who are considering trying Johnny Candido's uh, six-week strength program. Now, before I begin, some information about me. Uh, my name is uh, Stefan Constantinescu. I'm 29 years old. I'm six foot three, and this morning I weighed in at about <clears throat> 223 pounds. Uh, my history working out, I actually only started very recently. I mean, of course I worked out on and off for, for a while, but I, I, was, I was out of it for, for years until about, I want to say, two to three years ago I started taking it uh, se seriously. Uh, and I chose the sport of powerlifting, frankly, because I was a bit, um, what's the word I want to use? Not confused, but I made the same mistakes everybody else makes. I walk into a gym, I'm like, I'm going to use that machine, that machine, that machine, that machine, that machine. I'm only going to target all the muscles I can see in the mirror and forget about anything else. Uh, so... When I learned about powerlifting, how there's only three lifts, essentially, plus the accessories, but let's forget about that for a second, um, I found it incredibly appealing. So I started with one of the most popular powerlifting programs out there, 5x5. Five five. And it worked wonderfully. Now, just to give you an idea of how weak I was, First of all, I've never deadlifted in my life. I never squatted in my life. I used a leg press. Hey, bro, I could leg press four plates, whatever. Um, and I wasn't really into benching because when I was in high school, I dislocated my shoulder twice. <clears throat> so anyway, 5x5 uh, five five worked for me wonderfully, but I changed it a little bit. First of all, I didn't bench because I've, I had shoulder issues my entire life and I've been ignoring it so that when I went on the bench press, honestly, honestly, I didn't bench because I was embarrassed. I didn't want to be the guy in the gym bench pressing the bar and then a 10 pound plate. And because of this embarrassment, I ignored the bench press for years. That changed very recently. It changed this August um, when I started uh, Johnny Candido's uh, six-week program. Now, why did I start his program? 5x5, five five, as I said, worked wonderfully for me for about a year and a half to two years, but then all of a sudden I was hitting plateaus. Worse, I was getting injured in the gym because I figured if this month I can deadlift 280, for example, then I will only bench lift 280 pounds for the rest of my life. I will never go under that. So as I got progressively heavier, I didn't know about this concept of undulation. I think that's the proper term where you cycle between heavy weight and then medium weight and then low weight. <clears throat> so I went on the internet and I did research and uh, I, I, I stumbled across Johnny Candido's YouTube channel, which I, I loved because he has this zero bullshit attitude. He's a huge proponent of the powerlifting sport um, and uh, tons of information, tons. So with that, let's begin with the review of the six-week program. I started it on August 10th, 2015. Today is, I want to say, yeah, today is January 22nd. I completed it, I completed four cycles of it. When I started the program on August 10th, 2015, uh, my max bench was 185 pounds. I'm, I have a log where I, I write all this down. My max squat was 335 pounds. And my deadlift was 385 pounds for a grand total of 905 pounds. Today was the last day of my fourth cycle of this program. And my theoretical max, which means the weight I performed at the, at the end of this program, multiplied by the multiplier Johnny specifies um, 
based on the number of reps. So for example, uh, I squatted 355 pounds on Monday for four reps. So my theoretical max is 385 pounds. I benched 190 pounds for two reps. My theoretical max, 195 pounds. And I deadlifted 440 pounds uh, today uh, for three reps. If you multiply that by 1.06 as per Johnny's spreadsheet, uh, my theoretical max, 465. So my theoretical total, theoretical, I haven't performed any of this, 1,045 pounds. Now, <clears throat> did I follow this program to the T? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. With a few notable exceptions. For example, if on the program I was supposed to do something on Thursday, but I had a prior engagement on Thursday, I would shift it over to Wednesday or Friday. Speaking about programming, um, another reason why I chose this this uh, six-week program was because there's a very handy Excel spreadsheet on Johnny Cantito's website. I mean, you put in the maxes, you put when you want to start, you choose some accessory exercises, and for the next six weeks, you know what to do. You don't walk in the gym and you're like, what am I going to do today? No, you walk in there with a, with a plan and then you execute said plan. Um... What else? Johnny recommended that you use his six-week strength building program while you are trying to maintain or even increase your weight. I did not do this. I used this as a cutting program because uh, I was doing five by five and it worked well. And of course, I read on the, on the internet, the more you eat, the more you lift. So I ballooned, ballooned up to about 260 pounds. Reminder, I'm six foot three. Um, when I started Johnny Candido's program, again, August 10th, 2015, today is um, January 22nd, I record my weight every morning after I pee. Uh, so according to my logs, scrolling through my fitness pal, give me one second, I have to scroll quite a ways away. When did I start? August, August 10th. Yeah, here we go. When I started his program, I was 249 pounds. 249 pounds. And today I am 200, uh, and was it 22 or 23 this morning? 23, I think, yeah. Um, so I lost weight, but I also put about 100 and 905, 1,045. I put about 100, I put 140 pounds on my total while I lost over 20 pounds. Now, at one point I was about 213, uh, 213, 214, but I was weak as shit. Like I cut, of course I didn't have a six pack, but I just, I restricted my, my, my carbohydrates and my calories to such an extent that my performance in the gym was, was garbage. Uh, and this happened around, around the holidays. Like I was preparing myself for the holidays because I knew, I knew, every, every, everybody knows, in the holidays you're going to eat a lot. So I got down to about 213, 214, and right now I'm, I don't want to say I'm trying to bulk, uh, but I am trying to find a number, a weight, uh, an amount of food I can eat every day and not gain too much weight. I would like to end 2016 weighing 230 pounds maximum 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 right now I weigh about like I said two, 223 um, so after four cycles of Johnny Candida's program what have I learned the benching section doesn't work it simply doesn't work for me um, now why wouldn't it work probably because when I was doing five by five <clears throat> I didn't bench I overhead pressed. For some strange reason, I thought that if I overhead pressed, that would be a good substitute for the bench press. Some might say it is, um, whatever. I ignored the bench because I was Im embarrassed. 
when I started Johnny Can Johnny Candido's program, I said, you know what? Fuck it. Enough being embarrassed. Um, this is actually so sorry. This was before I started his program. I want to say a month or two before. I went into the gym every Sunday at like 12 o'clock in the afternoon when it was completely empty and I would be the only person in there. And I would bench with the bar, with a 10 pound plate, with two 10 pound plates. And I quickly, quickly, quickly got up to that 185 pound uh, max. That being said, when I started Johnny Candido's uh, program, I, 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 I inputted that 185 max into his uh, spreadsheet. And frankly, I, j I just don't think there was enough volume or I started at a very weak point. I was doing crazy volume. When you're benching a bar at a 10 pound or two 10 pound plates, you can go 10 by 10. You can. Um, so I, I got up to 185 pounds from like 65 pounds in two months, pretty much, doing insane amounts of volume. I would hog a, a bench press and basically just bench for an hour straight. Because A, I was weak and I could, recovery was very fast. And B, um, at that point I, I hadn't started cutting yet. I only started cutting like um, towards the end of August. Um, on two occasions I got sick. And I got sick to such a degree you know, of course, I wanted to be the asshole in the gym, like, oh, I'm re, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm sick, but it's okay. It's just the sniffles. Um, and I went to the gym anyway. And for example, I would have like three sets of three on the deadlift. By the time I finished that first set, I felt like I got hit with a train, and I would have to take a week off because I would be just, I would be that sick. And when I came back to the gym, I would simply restart where that week was so if i if i stopped if i took a week off during week three of the program uh, i would resume from week three when i went back to the gym speaking about the name of the program he says it's a six-week program and i understand why he says it's a six-week program because johnny assumes during the sixth week you perform you try to find your max, like you test out the max. Um, all the figures you calculate, you're supposed to, to, to test those. I don't. I don't. Um, at the end of the fifth week, I would take the calculated theoretical squat, deadlift, and bench, and I would shove those excuse me, I would shove those into the program and start over. So it's more like a five-week program, and I was doing it over and over and over again. Uh, so where, where do I want to go forward? Um, like I said, I want to put on about seven pounds this year. Um, hopefully muscle. <laughs> um, uh, it would be nice to have a, a six-pack, but... <sighs> Who knows if that's going to happen. Um, I'm not. That's not my goal. I want to get stronger, uh, at least today. Um, I am going to keep on using Johnny's program, with the exception of the bench. I'm going to uh, switch back to 5x5 five five on the bench. Um, and I'm going to use, this is my plan, I'm going to use an 80% of my theoretical one rep max. So 80% of 195 is, uh, I, I did the math earlier, I think it's 155 pounds, which is basically one plate and one uh, 10 pound uh, plate. And I'm going to do five by five for the entire program, the entire program. And then when I start the next cycle, I'll add a 2.5 pound plate on each side. So, so basically increase by five. Um, I need the volume. I need the volume, I'm a very weak bencher, and I need the volume, period. So on the days when the program says bench, I will, I will do 5x5 five five instead of what is currently in the spreadsheet. Um, so yeah, 
I wanted to make this video because it's the beginning of the year. A lot of you are considering going back to the gym. I mean, I'm I'm one of those guys. I went back to the gym because it was a New Year's resolution. I was tired of being a, a little fat and pudgy and yada yada yada. And with powerlifting, it's 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 stuck. Like three lifts, you can easily see how you're progressing in the gym. Um, Powerlifting is great. Use use his program, um, and that's it. If you have any questions, I'm going to do something I usually don't do. I'm going to leave the comments open below. Um, ask away, ask away. You know what? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I was going to give you my email address, but fuck that. Um, ask me questions in, in the comments, and I will try my best to reply. And Johnny, if you're watching this, uh, welcome to Texas. Um, if I remember correctly, you have recently moved to Houston. Uh, I'm up in Dallas. And um, yeah, thank you for everything. Th thank you for making your program free. And um, keep powerlifting. Bye.